Now then guys, just back out on the range testing a little something I've made for the WMR AR15, thought I'd show you it. Uh, if you know, if you've seen any of my previous videos, you know two things about me. One, I've got a functioning last round bolt hold open working for these guns, and two, I've got an extremely sexy on camera persona. Uh, you're welcome for both. But I uh, just thought I'd come out today, show you these. Um, if you know anything about these guns, you know they run from 14 round Black Dog magazines. Now, that capacity obviously isn't great, it's nowhere near as much as you'd get in something like a 22 long rifle gun. So that was the next real sticking point for me, was making a, a bit more of a high capacity magazine. So, I got to work on making these. Now, if that was a little bit fast for you, don't worry, I've got another one. And I'll go nice and slow with this one so you guys can count out with me at home. Now, you boys in Norfolk, you're probably going to need all six of your fingers for this. So, pull them out your sister and join in. No, if my maths is on point, I'll make that 20 rounds. Whew. So yeah, there you go, 20 round magazines. Now, these are on here, a magazine extension. They're using the standard Black Dock magazines, feed lips, everything like that, and follower. It's just an extension I've machined for the, for the magazine itself. Um, they will actually hold slightly more than 20 rounds. I think they're topping out about 23, but at 23 you're really jamming those uh, rounds in there and then when you've got 23 rounds in there as well you can't actually close, uh, insert the magazine on a closed bolt similar to the Black Dog 14 rounders if you've got 14 rounds in you really struggle to, to get the magazine you've got to slam it in which I'm not a big fan of I don't know why people design magazines like that to be honest um, but yeah when I set out to, to make these I had two goals one was a minimum capacity of 20 rounds which I've achieved and the other was to kind of keep a a similar form factor to a like a standard NATO mag, a Stanag mag, P mag, whatever. Uh, and again, I've kind of done that. That's pretty much the exact profile of a, of a P mag. So for your pouches and all that kind of type of jazz, it works really well. Now I know some of you are probably sat screaming, well, "Why didn't you make a you know 30 round mag? Why didn't you make a 25 round mag for these?" You know, and I get it. You know, 22 long rifle guns and that you 25, 30 rounds is a is a staple for them. Truth is, I did actually make a 25 round mag for these a few months ago. Some of you might have seen a little snippet of it on the Facebook page. But I kind of flew a little bit too close with the sun with that one. I made it 25 rounds capacity, I incorporated my bolt hold open feature into it, and it, it just made it a little bit unreliable. Um, it worked, I'd say, probably 75% of the time, but that's nowhere near good enough. It was actually uh, causing a lot of out of battery detonations. Rounds were going off in the top of the mag instead of chambering, which is suboptimal <laughs> should we say but the last round bolt hold open was actually the thing that worked on it 100 percent it's just that it would kind of sometimes explode from time to time so <laughs> not the best <laughs> so yeah that's why i kind of settled on a 20 round capacity instead of 25 for now i figured i'd get a reliable extended magazine working a 20 round magazine working Give it a thorough testing make sure it's nice and tried and tested i've got about 150 175 ish rounds on these now i've got two mags made up this one and this one oh, not that one Whee! that one um so yeah about 150 odd rounds through them both now uh, running really well no no issues so far and um, but yeah so you've got to kind of understand that wmr is a bit of a knobhead of a caliber to work with so yeah i want to make sure these are functioning fully functioning first before I start incorporating the bolt hold open or, or increasing the capacity further I'm sure it's doable but I uh, just want to take little baby steps with it really so I figured that'd be something you guys might be interested in I'm gonna close the video out by shooting off a few more mags for you a uh, little montage maybe but yeah if you've uh, if you've enjoyed the video go ahead and like it subscribe to the channel that stuff really helps me out you know um, I, don't, I don't actually know if it does I'm kind of new to all this but that's what everyone else seems to say so whatever uh, any questions or comments or anything you've got just ask them down below uh, in the comments and I'll uh, always try and get back to you unless you've just been a dick in which case you go and play in the road but um, yeah cheers guys
took my dash.